Okay, so let's create a podcast in Blackboard. All right, so I'm in Blackboard now. The first thing that you want to do is to set up your podcast. So go into Course Tools and scroll down to where it says Manage Podcasts. And you click on that. It opens up a Manage Podcast window. You can title your feed. And basically what you're doing by setting up the podcast is setting up the feed. So you can leave it as it is automatically labeled like this or you can change it you can write a description you can upload a file I uploaded a little icon so that it, it shows uh, uh, up when people subscribe to your podcast and then you want to click everyone so that you get this URL and then after you save it you want to copy this URL because this is how people subscribe to your podcast how students will subscribe and then you just hit submit and you're ready to go Okay, so now to add a podcast anywhere in Blackboard, so let's say you're in Module 1 here, and at the very bottom of my Module 1, I'm playing around with this, so I added at the very bottom a podcast episode right here. And the way that I did that was just right up here where it says More, I can add a podcast episode. Now, what happens is it'll open up an area where I can give it a title, so let's give this another title. Okay, and then you can um, upload the file. So let's say you recorded your podcast using something like Audacity or your iPod Touch. You recorded it using the recorder that we talked about. Um, you can upload that file or you can uh, link to a file. Now what you can't do here is record. So what you have to do is attach a file that you created elsewhere using something like Audacity, like I said before. And you just sort of go into your um, computer and find your podcast that you created. So I've created uh, a podcast here for my 101 class. I can just simply grab the MP3 file and it's going to attach itself here. So now I just uh, I can add files so maybe I have an assignment that goes along with uh, that podcast so if students are supposed to be working on say assignment number three or four uh, or assignment number seven <laughs> uh, I can attach a file to it now the good thing is that if it's a PDF file those files will show up in the RSS feed okay so I'm gonna make the episode available and I hit submit and then that URL that I copied a, a while back, what I can do is go into iTunes. Here's my iTunes. Okay, so I'll go into Advance and say subscribe to a podcast. I add that URL in there and say OK. And then it shows up here. And then what I could do is every time the podcast, is there's a new episode, I can update it and it'll show up. So that new one that I just added test number three is now downloading and showing up so I can get them all and then they would all download the picture that I added is not showing up though but this is how students can subscribe to your podcast now the good thing about this there's some good and bads but the good thing about it is that you can put these podcast episodes anywhere so you can see that I added this first these first two or number one and number three here in module one but I added another podcast in Module 2. So no matter where you put them within Blackboard, they will all show up in the feed. So there's another podcast there. So all three of those that I added are downloading right now as we speak to iTunes. And that would happen automatically. So if a student subscribes, as soon as you create a podcast somewhere in Blackboard, it'll show up. Okay, so that's it for now.